Bob plays it. They go short side. Bob from the line. He's got this one down. 30 seconds left on the clock. I think it's going to be too little, too late now for the Bulls. Going to the halftime break down by two. They'll feel like they're definitely still in this match, and that's exactly what they're going to do. Tanner Martin straight through, and it was a beautiful ball there from Jardel Bob. Self, little sneaky potential sub there as Bob heads towards the line. Oh, beautiful short ball. He opened up the gap, and Laurie was good enough to storm all the way through it. Slows it once the strike up. Now they'll try and launch the raid. Tika with a long ball. They can pop it back on the inside with Frost. Oh, Frost, what a cover play that was from Jardel Bob. He shut it down when it looked like a try for all money. Bob, he'll get himself into half. Picks up, goes that early release yet again. He's coming off the right foot. Looks like a little bit of an air swing, and I think it might be back-to-back -back tries from Tommy Green. He's got the CQ Bulls right back into this match and level pegging on the scoreboard. And Martin, the two middles operating effectively so far. Bob with a long pass. They caught Castles absolutely stranded. Laurie keeps the width, and the first try of the drop-off goes the way of the Central Queensland Bulls. 9-8 on the paint-away scoreboard.